Guys, we're back for this Blitz review of John Barbados. John Barbados. <laughs> <laughs> Dark Rebel. Alright, and uh, yeah, we're gonna be doing a little unboxing of this. Oh my god, I did it again! Ah! <laughs> Alright, I'm excited to smell this one. If I can open the box. Challenge opening the box. <laughs> Ten years later. <laughs> This is Godly here. Welcome back to my channel, Godly Sits for the People. If you're new to this channel, please subscribe below. I, of course, I have Valencia here too. Of course, we're going to do another Blitz review. And that is John Varvatos, Dark Rebel. And uh, with this fragrance, it's beautiful. I heard it's beautiful. Uh, we're going to be doing a first impression also on the smell because I haven't smelled it yet. So we're going to be also unboxing it. So let's get right into it. I love uh, manly scents and also I love freshness. So hopefully this is a uh, fresh scent and it's manly as well. I heard great news of this. So I had to go ahead and pick it up and uh, I heard it's and you can wear it, you know, around the uh, winter time and, and fall. So we're going to be doing a uh, first impression also and then the unboxing. So we got Valencia here. She's going to be showing you the box overall, the detail. And as you see, this is the OLED toilette version. And then the, the package, the box has like little ripples of the, uh, you know, image of the fragrance also around it, like the basking, you know. So, all right, let's get into the fragrance in the bottle and what you think. Da, da, da. Here's right. the bottle. There's John Barbados. See the name inscribed. Rebel, you see the inscription on there. Okay. Bottle's black. Here's that signature weaving that John Barbados has on the outside of his bottles. Except this one isn't the um, like the twine that's on the other one. This one's more like the uh, plastic. She's referring to the artist in Aqua. Yeah. So that's how it looks. Cool bottle, I think. And then. The insignia on the top. Okay, awesome. We're gonna take. I'm gonna let her take a smell and what she thinks. If you wanna take a whiff on here. All right. There you go. Spray it on here. Yeah. Get me out of the shot. This is this is her channel now. <laughs> Whoa! Wow. Okay. Okay. First so, thoughts. Very in your face. Yeah. Um, definitely can smell pepper mm -hmm. in it. Um, there's some nutmeg in it. Okay. Uh, Cuban sugar rum. Okay. Tobacco. The, uh, Jamaican rum. Jamaican rum. <laughs> tobacco. You can smell. The, I think okay. you can smell all the hints of all. I definitely smell the tobacco. All the those hands, hands ingredients. Yeah. yeah. It's. Off those top, off the top notes. Yes. It's a powerful. Um, mm -hmm. It's a powerful fragrance. Like, unlike the last review of YSL, where I said if a man's walking by, you're not going to get a whiff of it. Yeah. I think this is one of the types of colognes that you will get a whiff if he just walks by. It's like, whoa, this. Oh, okay. Yeah. So, so the performance will. Uh, it's strong. Project. This is definitely a man's, a man's cologne for sure. Okay. Yeah. All right. See, I like the sound of that yeah. manly man. See? It is. I think it's for a grown man. Like guys, I, I feel like really with the YSL, just comparing the two real quick, uh -huh. that one. It's more of a teenage, young teenage man can wear it. It's it's but more soft. You, it's you're soft, saying? but this one is a strong. This is very commanding. I think okay. it's it's strong. It's definitely a man's skill. I, <laughs> I picture men in a tux with their cigars. kicking back. It is very, very good. Some scotch. <laughs> mm -hmm. I agree. It's strong. Yeah. <laughs> scotch. I typically 
don't care for the super peppery overpowering smells but i think once it settles down if i just smell do you smell right? any vanilla it does have a hint of vanilla because although it starts it Mexican will, vanilla guys yeah it'll start off as powerful but then once it settles down and dries down mm -hmm. then you get the sweetness oh, okay. of it right. yeah yeah for sure all right well my overall thoughts of it is that it is powerful it does project um, very well um, it reminds me I do, it reminds me of like a like a cigar also, like she said. Mm -hmm. um, I smell the rum, the Jamaican rum. It's very good. I also uh, know that the sillage is about six or seven hours. And our ability is about, <laughs> is about <laughs> I give that about a uh, seven or eight because um, you can wear it between the fall and the winter, so. Mm -hmm. I agree now with her on everything that she said. Now we don't know what the dry, the dry down may be, or we don't know how it will reflect uh, on our skin and how it will perform off skin. So, but overall, I uh, probably give it a nine. What do you think? What's your rating? Just for me, um, I give it about an eight, eight point five. But it definitely is a man's cologne for sure. Okay. Because I, I'm. Will this be a first, you know, go-to that you would want me to wear or anybody else to wear? Um, I know you like these kind of fragrances. You tend to typically be on this powerful side, but I love sweet smells. Okay. So, loam is... Loam is... Loam is... Yeah. Loam is the loam, I tell you. I guess it's, it's kind of essential in a way. This one is very, like I said, it's very commanding. Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah. So it's like, come here. <laughs> in That's, way. in a way, it's kind of like if a guy saying, hey, notice me. Oh, so, so, so is it doing too much or is it not doing too much? No, I don't think it's doing too much. It would be if you put too much on. I think you should only probably do maybe one, two, or maybe two to three. Two to three sprays. Sprays. Wow. Um, any more than that would be too much. Like I don't know if you could wear this in an office environment because mm. it's kind of it's kind of strong. Okay. All right. Maybe if you're the CEO. All right. Get away. With it. <laughs> <laughs> I agree. But it doesn't smell bad or anything. It does smell good for its category of fragrance and what it is. And it's okay. John Barbados and All this right. cologne smell nice. Well, she gave her thoughts and. Uh, I gave mine, so hopefully you guys enjoy this. Like, comment, subscribe below, and uh, yeah, and uh, we'll see you next time. Thanks, guys. See ya.